Hello all, welcome to PC Tips Pro and in today's video we are going to see about how to use Gmail offline on laptop or PC. Before getting into the video, if you guys have, haven't yet subscribed to the PC Tips Pro, please do subscribe. And now let's get started. So firstly we need to log into this Gmail account of yours. So I have logged into mine. So here I have few like these mails and all these are available for us in online mode. Uh, so now let's uh, you can just find in the top right. You can find the settings option. So in order to use this mails offline, like when you want to like urgently check mails, uh, which are recent and all. So in that in such cases, you might be needing this offline uh, uh, use of this offline Gmail. To, to do that like you just need to go to the settings and click on it and here you can just find see all settings option go to it and uh, this could load and you will be landing onto this kind of uh, interface here uh, we just need to uh, see like look for the offline one click on the offline so this asks us to enable the offline mail so here we need to just check this and here it asks us like uh, you need to uh, you want to store emails from last how many days let's say that i just want for seven days or 30 days or 90 days so you can do up to 90 days let's say that i want for seven days and i also want to want this gmail to have the attachments that are sent through those mails so that i can download it even offline and uh, and there is another thing that is for security like after logging out of your google account so if you you want to keep the offline data on the computer or uh, it is something like uh, the data that is stored in your dev device will not be deleted when signing out so or when changing the password so to delete the data your device uh, uh, should disable this offline mail and it needs to ch uh, save the changes like you need to disable this offline mail or else you can even remove the offline data from the computer so you can choose one of this so as of now i'll just choose the keep offline data on my computer and once we are done we can just click on the save changes and um, okay so here we can see that off offline is not recommended for shared devices and this emails will remain on this device until the offline mail is disabled so you shouldn't be using this on the devices that um, is being shared by somebody else and now we are done so now let me turn off my internet connection and just show you like how this works um, but before that to use it in the offline mode you need to bookmark this particular page so you can just um, create a bookmark you can go here and click on the star you can give the folder or like the name to be something like gmail and then i'll just uh, make it to the bookmarks bar click on the done so now i'm done with it so now let me just uh, turn off my wi-fi now i have turned off my wi-fi and now i'm going to this gmail and let's see how this works so even though like i'm just using this bookmarked uh, bookmarked website which is available for me here i could see that i am offline and here it shows that some of the functionalities may be unavailable but i could see the mails that are from past seven days so i can just open them and uh, look at them and even i can send the mails by clicking on the compose button i can share the mail to the I can share mail to myself and click on the send so this shows that like uh, this is an offline one so the message will be sent once uh, it gets the Wi-Fi or internet connection so this is how you can check the mails or send the mails through Gmail in the offline mode this is all for this video guys I hope you found this video useful to you don't forget to like, share and subscribe to PC Tips Pro. Thank you for watching.